few. And also don't forget independent schools. They are headed back to class today. Some of those kiddos going to get to learn in a pretty cool new environment. Jessica too. Reyes yeah, is live this morning there. And Jessica, what makes this place so unique? Well, this is not your typical school building. This actually used to be an dealership. Now, what's so cool about this is that they are keeping some of those old features and they're going to repurpose them. For example, this right here, if you look closely, you can still see that this is the front lobby of what used to be a car dealership. Now, though, it's going to be the new student run art gallery. Now, the major changes, though, those are going to be inside the building and the biggest one being adding a TV studio with state of the art technology. Now, the student run t-shirt printing shop will also be here. The point of all this is to give students firsthand experience in different fields to help them figure out what they want to do once they graduate high school. And when it came to choosing what programs to offer here, well, the superintendent says that was an easy decision. And we're looking for job opportunities for our kids that are, are high demand and high wage. And so we actually reverse engineer to get what offerings we're going to have. And then this space was just terrific for everything that we wanted to add in. And some of the programs that are offered here were actually at different schools and other programs are just brand new to the district. What is very impressive, though, is how much this building costs the district. I'll tell you how much it is coming up in 30 minutes. Reporting live in Independence, I'm Jessica Ray.